Hey guys, it's Will here, and today's video is all about face masks. My face mask collection, ways that I wear face masks, and also how to treat and prevent acne. Let's get right into it. For anyone just finding me, hi, my name is Will Samayoa. I'm an LA-based lifestyle vlogger and content creator. I'm an active blog called Words by Will, where I share lifestyle information, whether it's like fitness, fashion, skincare, style, to help you be the star of your own life. In today's video, we're talking about three big things. We're talking about my face mask collection, face masks for all skin types and all different kinds of lifestyles. We're also talking about how to treat and prevent maskne, aka face mask acne. And the third thing is how to make face masks functional. I think that fashion and function always have all kinds of intersections and face masks are no different. They are now part of our everyday carry item routine. If you probably see any of my social medias, you will see that I am a huge proponent of styling face masks and making them a fashion moment. Before we get into my mask haul, I wanted to show you guys how I store my mask. First tip in how to keep your face mask clean and clear from breakouts from wearing face masks. There's a logic to my madness as there always is with everything Will does. On this side of the basket is where I keep all of my clean face masks. And so I stack all of my masks so I can just grab a mask from the top. I am making sure that I am touching less masks when I go to reach for one and I always have a fresh one at the top. In the middle, I usually keep the carbon filters for my mask. This is just a bag from Lululemon. You can honestly use whatever type of bag you want. And in here, I just kind of shoot everything that I'm using. You put any of your dirty and used face mask. I've got posts ranging from where I buy my face mask, how to find the perfect face mask for an active lifestyle, how to treat and prevent masking with my favorite skincare product. With that being said, let's talk about my face mask collection. Also want to give a quick disclaimer, I already washed my hands and I actually have hand sanitizer on the side because it is so important that when you're touching your mask, you them the right way. So the first mask we're going to start off with, the sister to the other mask I was wearing, is a cloth face mask by Coach. Now this is a layered face mask that has the pouch for the carbon filters that I was talking about. Now these masks from Coach have a little bit of a scratcher cotton, I'm not gonna lie. These are again, are a little bit better for like a fashion moment. And speaking about fashion, I wanna introduce you guys to face mask chain. Now you guys have probably seen this tree in the background of a lot of my videos. It's got a lot of chains on it. But one thing that I don't think a lot of people have recognized is these are not only necklaces, but they are multi-use chains. The black chain that I was wearing earlier. So I love these chains in particular. They are from Pretty Connected Shop. So this is the black skinny chain that I'm using as a face mask chain. However, I could easily take off face mask and make it a necklace. This way you don't have to worry about putting your mask on a table, putting it in your hand or putting it in a bag. So you're getting both fashion and function when you're using a face mask chain. So these are face masks from Old Navy. I got two different sets. I got one in these more utility colors and then in essential neutral colors. I opted in for a utility color like a lot of utility and streetwear style. Perfect for a lot of the clothes that I already have and clothes that I've been purchasing in quarantine. Let's be honest, who is not going crazy with online shopping? I also got a pack of face masks that were just in different red tones because as you can tell, red is one of my favorite colors. So I had like reds, pinks, purples. I ended up giving some to my grandma and my sister. And that is another reason why I love buying these cotton face masks and reusable face masks in general in bulk because you can get a ton for yourself and also for your loved ones and friends who need some masks. This is a great segue into talking about how to treat my mask and prevent future face mask acne was investing in a good double cleanse process. Now for those unfamiliar with a double cleanse, that is a part of a skincare routine. It should be your first one when you're going in with two products. First one will be an oil-based cleanser and the second one will be more of a gentle gel. Go into the link below, favorite skincare products for treating masks. I love the Verse Daily Dissolve Balm. I also love the Summer Friday Super Amino Gel Cleanser. In both my blog and all of my Instagram Q&A and stories, I am always highlighting these. These are the Slip Silk face coverings. We already know silk is so good for your skin. This is a black silk face mask. What I love about these masks is they are layered and they also have a little hole at the top where you can put in an adjustable little metal loop. You get a better securing around your nose because remember, you always want to wear your face mask over your nose, not under it. And we've got a plain rose gold right here. For those edgy and looking for the wild side, we've got a leopard pattern. And then for those who live by also extra means, we've got these rose gold leopard pattern. Now we're going in with another one of my favorite chains. This is from Key Australia. It's also a multi chain and you can use these for both face mask and as a sunglass holder. Another one of my favorite combinations, black silk face mask with this gold Key Australia box link chain. So I reach for this mask more when I don't have any other options because at the end of the day, it is literally just a basic black cotton face mask with a hole for a carbon filter. It's a very scratch material. This one is very irritative to my skin. And I recommend getting one that has a middle pouch so you can put a filter in it because again, you just wanna make sure that you're protecting yourself and others.
Remember, if any of these face masks or chains are speaking to you, you can check out the description below because I'm gonna have links to my like to know and also my blog where you can shop these masks directly. So the last masks in my mask color are kind of like miscellaneous masks that I've either gotten kind of as PR gifts or that I just kind of bought on a whim. This is the first mask that I got as a PR gift. This is from Babe Wine. You can see from the material, this is very much kind of like a flimsy mask. It is by no means comfortable. Honestly, I don't really recommend these kind of like free masks. As you can tell, it's like more on the cheaper side and especially when it comes to something like a face mask, you don't want to opt in for like cheat and flimsy, but I'm going to keep it because hey, it was free. This is the next mask that I got kind of as PR and as a gift. I absolutely love this mask, you guys. If you haven't seen my latest travel vlogs, I spent an amazing weekend in Boston with some of my best friends. And so we were in the seaport in Boston and there was kind of like a community person giving out free face masks. I don't know exactly what it is. It almost looks like kind of like an activewear material and it's got the handy dandy pouch in the middle. Now this is a face mask that I got as a gift when I was working Outfest. In case you guys don't know, I am a full-time film publicist here in LA. And so we had a film that was having a drive through premiere. This one is again, another kind of one. There's no like layering to it or extra pockets. So again, it's not a mask that I reach for often. Nice little mask that serves as a memento. This is another PR mask. We have these cool face masks as part of a social media campaign that we're running. Unlike other PR masks, this material is very nice. It's a lot more of that softer cotton. And this one is layered. You can feel it. However, it doesn't have a little slot to put in a filter. And then my last face mask in this haul is this face mask by Lonely Ghost. It is their follow me on Instagram mask. This one, I really love it because it's got the adjustable little ear loops. And even though it is a cotton face mask, it is one of the softest cotton masks that I own. It's actually one of my favorite masks, I think just because of the graphic on it. It's very like in your face, very wool samayo. And as you can imagine, I dig it. everyone that is it for this video again thank you so much for watching make sure to like subscribe share this video with someone if you learned something make sure to check out all of the links below because i'm gonna have blogs and places to shop these masks and these face mask chains thank you so much for watching this is wilson mayoa and i will see you in the next video